I got stung, boys. You see that? Them drowned hornets. I called them yellow jackets in my other video. It hurt. So, right in a freaking jugular, burber. Oh, you gotta love this. I just got stung in my freaking neck. Did I got stung? He's using the hoose varnish down there. Look at that nest. Oh, I was just trimming along and bam, it got on a Sunday. That ain't cool. Enough, we gotta do this big freaking miles of a hillside. There's y'all short clip. Do you see where the hole's at? Oh, he can. Where's the hole? Where? I think the stinger's in my neck. I'm trying to pull it out. Hey, straight up that mound right there. Oh. God dang, right in the jugular, son. I've been stung 10 million times doing pest control. See it right there? It's seven o'clock in the morning over here. Anyway, this is gonna be the first time ever using this first time I'm ever using this thing and I have to disclose who's born and did give it to me it is their new line for this year commercial grade 522 HDR 75s boy that's a mouth anyway and I use fluid film as y'all know Hasn't let me down all these years. I gotta run it and then spray some more on it. That's just my initial hosiery. Hosiery job. Then I'll spray it again. All right. I know this video's jumpy and stuff, but let's give it its maiden fuel. First time getting fuel. We will be using my leaky freaking no spill that spills. I hate this candy. I don't know why anybody likes this candy. My freaking neck hurts. Thanks for asking. The gaskets come out of this, the O-rings. Out of these sure cans. So I call them, they sh I mean sure can. No spill. But they sure can spill. Alrighty, there's your first fill up. A Husqvarna XP mix oil. I still use that. What are you? And we'll just keep it going. Y'all ain't live or nothing, but we'll see if it'll crank without me doing magic editing. The other one cranks one pull and stuff, but this one has never been started like ever. Primer bulb. Oh, that's a good sign. You never know where it's the first time. Let's make sure it gets circulated in there. Pull out the choke. Ooh, that's easy. It's, it's just like my residential one, I'm telling you. I'm trying to crank it to where y'all can see me. <laughs> Who's far? Now you did it again. My lord. Y'all heard it, didn't you? That's from brand spanking new. Kinda sounds like my other one. Alright, now that it's like that. What do y'all see? Now that it's like that, we're gonna hose her down again. Y'all see how this is made, right? Both blades are moving at the same time. The residential one I have is just a single. Let's go do this job. I should see though. But I'm gonna do it. We'll see how this turns out. If I don't leave my camera here, that'll suck. Oh, 
Also, they want them butchered, like cut all the way down almost. Works pretty, pretty good. Actually, it's amazing. Not because I love Husqvarna, because I've used hedge trimmers for for eons, years and years. I've never had a pair with a double action knife like that. Now I'm spoiled to it. I mean, I love my other pair, but man, oh man, I hope I don't get stung. There ain't bees in here. Now I'm all paranoid.
Are y'all still on? Yep. I didn't shape them. I wasn't supposed to. I'm only paid to lop them because we shape them in the fall. Part of the contract. So why waste? You know, I mean, I could do it and charge them more, but I don't want to do that. Keep it cheap for them. Unless they want it. If they want it, by golly, we'll do whatever they want. They know that. These need trimmed right here, too. Let's cut this off and see if it'll crank back. This break-in period is a rough for me, you know. There went my leg. Now I can fix this. Here, we're going to turn it off see if it... You stupid tripod. We'll turn it off see if it cranks back up. That's the first time, but if this thing is half as good, which you know it's going to be 10 times as good as the other who's farting one I have. Oh, mama. Before I put it up, let's lube her up. In case any rust or anything happens, you know. As far as anti-vibration, it works. Oh man, what'd I do that at? Good lord. First time out, and I already got a big freaking scratch. Why is that not surprising me? You just can't have nice things. Now, this end right here, I don't know if it's optional or not. I just put it on there because I wanted to. This guard right here was already on there. I'm not taking it off. The only guards I take off is on the trimmer. Not no dangerous head trimmer. You seen how good this thing cuts? Imagine what it would do to a phalange. And then let's put it back in my jungle gym. Shoot. If I can move that dang wire right the dang way. Of course it is. It's twice as good. Twice as expensive. Just drop my camera. That's all I do is tear stuff up. Alrighty. Off to the next one.